Welcome back to the show. Now, you know it's hard to train a pet. Imagine trying to get them to act in a movie. Backstage OL's Dave Morales sat down with director Josh Greenbaum to talk about his new movie. It's all about a lost dog trying to find its way home. I really should find my way back home. We could help. <laughs> We're completely lost, and my little puppy paw pads are really hurting right now. This could be a lot worse. How could this get worse? Huh? How could it get worse? Josh, good Dave. to meet you, man. Good to meet you. I'm a big fan of all your interviews, by the way. I watch all your interviews. Thank you, I sir. Do. I yeah. appreciate it. I was this. like, I know that guy. I know Dave. Yeah, you're great. <laughs> yeah. Dude, thank We've you. We've never you met. This is our first time meeting, but I'm a big fan. We're done. They always say quick <laughs> we're done. That was it. That's all you needed. Great. I will see you next By time. By the way, there's no. a movie called Strays. Go check it out. But also watch all of Dave's stuff. <laughs> uh, listen, it was W.C. Fields that said, I have to read this verbatim, never work with children or animals. Do you agree? You're smiling. Do you agree with that assessment or has it changed your mind? W.C. just didn't try hard enough. Ah. <laughs> no, I, of course, agree with that. It was difficult, but it was... Um, it was a difficult that I knew, right? I, of course, when I read the script, I know exactly what I'm doing. It's like, I'm gonna go make a movie where for, you know, 90% of the film is just four dogs on screen or more, 40 dogs at times. Um, and so, you know, it was very difficult, but I had an incredible team and my whole crew and my animal trainers. And because 95% of the film is, is real dogs. Um, I did not go the kind of full CG route. I only did that when we needed it or when it was sort of unsafe for the dogs. So. Definitely, WC was right, uh, but I just decided <laughs> to soldier on anyway. So, so who were the bigger divas? Was were, were it the the dogs, and there were some cats in there too, or was it like people like Will Ferrell? Was it Jamie Fox, Will Forte? <laughs> well, you know, I mean, F For Ferrell, Forte, Fox, those guys are big time divas, as you know. You know, really difficult to work with. No, no, it was the animals, and specifically, it was, as you pointed out, and I love cats. I'm not an anti cat person, but cats on film sets, I'm less in love with. It turns out they don't really want to do what you ask them. And I only needed them for that very brief scene, if you recall. Yeah. I needed them to sit on cardboard boxes and and just be there, just sit and stay. And that took us like an entire day of shooting. It was supposed to be like a three hours of my shoot day. And it was like, we lost a whole day of shooting because of those cats. So they were tricky. And then Benny, who plays Jamie Foxx, who's right over my shoulder here, Benny, the Boston Terrier was a little bit of it. He didn't like his feet in his paws in wet grass. So we had someone whose job it was to dry the grass before every scene. Uh, otherwise, the whole scene, he would go like this with his paws. He would sort of like move his paws up and down, which looked very odd for tough Jamie Foxx's character to be sort of prancing while he's delivering all his lines. So there's my two answers. The, the uh, Benny the Boston Terrier and the cats were the biggest divas. Thank you, Dave. Still ahead on Fun on the Run, more adventure. We all know rock climbing is a great time, but this next place I'm bringing you takes climbing fun to new heights. Stick with us.